sure to like, comment, subscribe. It is The Raw Show, so you better be tuned in, tapped in. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe to be tapped in with all my new and upcoming videos, okay? I just bust a nut. It shouldn't be that much alcohol, that's why I got it. I didn't want nothing with, oh. I'm just extremely grateful. I'm so grateful for another year of life. I'm so grateful for the people that I have in my life right now. It takes some I see you finesse. He finesse. Hey, I am currently 922 on the way to my mama's house. Get my makeup, my hair. When I tell y'all I've been moving, I get, I get it done. That's all I'm gonna say, I get it done. So right now I'm about to slide to my mama's house, change clothes, and then we are gonna head on to church. It's only like nine minutes left on this SD card, so I'm gonna try to use my space wisely when it comes to, you know, y'all seeing me. So I'll see y'all when I'm dressed and back in the car, and then after that we'll be at church. And then, girl, we gonna, we gonna recap about my birthday. It's so much I wanna chop it up with y'all about, so. We'll do a birthday update, what we got, recap. Yeah, we on the way to church, give me a sec. All right, y'all, I'm in the car, waiting for my mama. I love it when I'm dressed, people waiting on me, and then I'm on time, and then the other person isn't. Cause then I'd be like, dang, I could've stopped, went back, but we're gonna get there, I guess. Uh, probably like 10.30, 10.45-ish. So I'll see y'all when we get there. I'm not driving, so we'll get there when we get there. Recoup and try to upload that vlog, child, y'all. It's been a lot going on. 
but birthday was great so so grateful Taylor if you watching this thank you again baby girl birthday was 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 um, as I can see I did my hair girl took that other blonde bob out put the blonde I mean not bob I mean not blonde put the sew in back in girl sew that in today around two o'clock sew that in today chopped her okay now we gotta cut yeah right now we on the way to Bible study I won't go go at first I won't go go because I'm like girl priorities I want my hair done you know what I mean I need to get my hair done I've been walking around that's another reason I ain't been itching to get on camera y'all I said Lord if it's meant for me to go to Bible study let me finish this hair in time you understand what I'm saying and girl I finished it in time and now we on the way so I had to chop it up with y'all catch it up a little bit because I know y'all missed me um and it's been a couple days since my birthday um this vlog's probably not gonna be that long I'm trying to think if I want to add something to it towards the end maybe a little talking session or something but I am gonna play my little jams because I know yeah <laughs> yeah so I missed y'all let's get into the ball BLB so they calling you Bob 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 Bob
right, y'all, I made it. I'm about to walk on in, and it is only 7-Eleven. Is this a record on timeness? Let's talk about it. We're gonna do better every, each and every time. Children of Israel, because we're naturally people who can't worship God, we'll find anything to worship. That's why you be real careful in very vulnerable moments in your life who you talk to, what you watch, what you read, what you listen to. Why? To the spirit realm, anything has access to you. Be, be careful. When you're, when you're, you're offended, we talk about that. When you're offended, be careful you talk to. Oh. 
time. Pookies, it's Friday, two o'clock, not nah, three o'clock. Just got out of meeting. I look crazy. We're not talking about that right now. So I'm about to show y'all the outcome of. Why does my hair look like this? I still feel like I need to cut it. You know what I mean? Like I'm still trying to get a little whatever tool. I ain't put no heat on it all in the past couple days. So you get what you get. So this is the barbecue chicken. I need to put in the frying pan because I didn't want to cross contaminate that with my chicken and gravy. So that's the barbecue. This is the chicken and gravy. Ooh, that looks good. Oh, oh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. I just bust a nut. I'm not gonna lie. Nah, cuz. I really want, I need y'all to get into this. I need y'all to get into this and get into it fast. You see that? Do you see this? I did that. I did that. Y'all, y'all know I'm gonna give you a review. Y'all know I'm gonna give y'all a review. Girl, what? I gotta find some new stuff to cook because at this point I'm a pro. <laughs> It's a little later on in the day. Um, I just made some asparagus and I'm about to make some mashed potatoes. And then we're gonna taste test the chicken. So, yeah. Asparagus is nice and green. She's ready, nice and cooked. It literally takes no time. I just add salt, yeah, I probably can't see. I just add salt, pepper, well not really salt and garlic, Salt, I think that's what it's called. Really salt, okay. Really salt and garlic salt. I mean, salt and garlic powder, pepper, powder. Yikes! Hold up. Season, garlic season. Right now, I'm about to make the mash. Ooh. I'm gonna make the mash and then we're going to do a taste test. And I did buy this. Well, I would just show y'all when we do the taste test. As my snipers hit their marks and your guards fall down from a rifle to the heart like that. Alright, Boogie, so here we are. I'm about to do a taste test. We have the asparagus. Matter of fact, let's take a seat. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and do the taste test. First, I don't know what we should try. I already know the sides are gonna be good. So I really don't feel a need in trying them. So let's try the barbecue chicken first. All right. 
very tender. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I like the sweet baby ray sauce more than I like the craft. So moving forward, we're not getting craft no more. It's not nasty, but that um sweet baby rays is something about it, girl. It is something about it. Asparagus is good, nice and tender, nice and seasoned. Sometimes I have a tendency to over cook asparagus, but it's perfect. That's good. So now I'm gonna try. My hair looks much better. Now I'm gonna try the chicken and gravy. Okay. This I'm nervous for because the gravy is key. Mm. Girl. Oh my gosh. Girl. 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 My godmother. She could cook, right? And she was known for a plethora of different dishes she can make, like her potato salad and her baked chicken. When I tell you, I don't know, I must have learned something subconsciously watching my godmother slash pastor back in the day, watching her in that kitchen cooking for services and stuff, because that, that type of pastor, like, she was the one that would cook when we had guest services, like, Anyway, I don't want to get emotional. But yes, I must have seen, took notes or something. Because, girl, that, that big chicken, that big chicken ain't no joke. Girl, what? I love it more than I love the barbecue. I told my mama I was going to share, girl. I don't know. <laughs> if you see this, girl, if mama, if you see this and you didn't get that chicken, you know why. Okay? Yikes. So good. It's boom. So something else I did want to try was I bought this from the store today, y'all. Um, it's the Sutter Home Peach Tea, black tea with peach, a wine cocktail. It shouldn't be that much alcohol, that's why I got it. I didn't want nothing with, oh, 7.5%. I won't be drinking too much of this then. Anyway, it's a little taste times. Maybe it's 7.9 for all four of them. Cause it's four little pieces like that. It's four little things. So maybe it's, hmm. I don't like, ooh girl. I do not like that. Ooh girl. Oh girl, I do not like that. They can cut that. Oh my gosh. All right, y'all. So anyway, that is going to be it for today. Today is Friday. I know y'all probably like, girl, I'm going to give y'all a recap of my birthday. It's just been a lot going on this week. And I've been really, like, tired, y'all. Like, I think I had to, like, recoup from prepping for my B-Day, doing the B-Day, all the things. So I'm going to get up with y'all tomorrow or maybe sometime later today because, yeah. But I'll get up with y'all before this vlog is over. Baked chicken, I'm gonna give it 10 out of 10. Falling off the bone, gravy is great, nice consistency, it's good, it's good. The barbecue chicken, I'll give seven out of 10 because I didn't make my sauce. I didn't, I used a different type of sauce instead of making my own and I'm not doing it anymore. This set of home peach tea wine cocktail, I give it a five, girl. They could have kept that, but anyway, girl. See you. Saturday, so it is next day. Um, Y'all, I didn't do nothing last night, but go to sleep. I went right to bed after I ate that food, which was, okay. I went to sleep, woke up, like one o'clock in the morning, straightened up my house a little bit, and went right back to sleep, girls. Literally edited this vlog, so everything's edited up until here. And went right back to sleep, girls. So, I wanted to come on camera because I had to do a birthday recap with y'all. Literally, y'all, my birthday was so good. 10 out of 10. Like, I literally didn't have to do anything. I didn't have to drive. I didn't have to, like, I had to make myself pay for stuff because 
my friend was like, you know, trying to accommodate so much, which I'm so thankful for. It was just such a blessed birthday, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna show y'all the gifts that my sore got me because I know y'all seen the bag, but I'm not sure y'all seen the context. She got me a bottle and then she got me these creep scrunchies. They're nice and fluffy, so cute. It's um, perfume, John Mark Putty. Okay, it smells really good. It's really sweet. Yeah, it's sweet, which I like. Sweet with a little bit of like, I don't know, mint to it. She bought me this, this guest perfume, which I've never had and I'm about to try it. I didn't even open it or smell it yet. I wanted to wait until y'all got on with, with me. Let's smell. Oh, girl. Mmm. Mmm. Yes. Tell them it smells so good. Thank you, girl. Oh, my gosh. It's guest seductive. So grateful. This one's so good. But yes, y'all, that was my, um, that's what I got. Um, I did receive money from my mom. So, um, when you get older, you become 25, you will already know, like, with the gift and the things, people don't really care. You doing good to get a happy birthday for folks. So, I'm just extremely grateful. I'm so grateful for another year of life. I'm so grateful for the people that I have in my life right now. At 25, I'm just being, standing on boundaries, standing on reciprocation. If it's not reciprocated, I'm not doing it. Birthday really show me that despite the bad apples, the ones that you did pour into, you're gonna get your harvest from that. So I'm just so, so grateful, so grateful y'all. But Baltimore as a whole, I was feeling it. It reminded me of back home. By the first night, we was on the block. We went to, cause I ain't show y'all that part. I showed y'all a little bit when we was on the block, but we was downtown and we went to that little chicken spot right on the block where it reminded me very much of my hood. It did, like crackheads and everything. Like it reminded me very much of the city. At that point, I'm like, oh, this mommy at home. Um, I'm like, girl, I can move here. Girl, when this lease is up. But then when I talked to my sorority, she was like, girl, please. When a person that's from Baltimore, living in Baltimore, tells you Baltimore is cute to visit, but don't move here, you listen. My friend got a, a parking ticket for parking at the park. It was the dumbest thing ever. It's crazy, traffic ain't the best. And then when she told me that the niggas be broke, I said, girl, what? Well, I said, Kings. But the Kings be broke. She told me you'll see a man, and she was right because on that block, it was some fine men out there, and they looked, they was dressed nice. Okay, she told me, she said, you'll see a man dressed down in Balenciaga girl sleeping in his car. A lot of these men is broke. -y. So when she told me that, I'm like, ooh, that's so disheartening, so disappointing, because they're so fine. They're so fine. But to know you're so fine and have nothing going for yourself is highly disappointing. Yikes! That factored in together, um, and you know, Baltimore is a little hood, but again, where I'm from is a little hood, so I'm really not, that didn't really take me out. What took me out was she told about the men. Cause you can be fine baby, but you got to do something. Okay, you got to do something. I just wanted to come on and give y'all a recap of that. It was so great, 10 out of 10. I'm so grateful again. Thank you Taylor for treating me so nice. It was just a great experience. The game was fun. It was just a great experience. I have never been to a professional football game. But at this big grown age 25, yeah. But it was just a great, a great, great birthday. And I'm just so grateful to God. So grateful just period, so. All right, now we are about to get dressed. Well, I'm already dressed, let's put my shirt on. I'm about to head to work out. And yes, I'm taking y'all with me this time since we got a good old tripod. Um, y'all be able to come with me with that. So let's go. And after that, I'm gonna go take this plate to my mama's house because um, I want her to try my food. I want her to try my baked chicken and that barbecue chicken. I'm really more excited for her to try the baked chicken. Um, and I know y'all probably like, girl, have you been working your one, two? I'm like, girl, no. Well, I guess it's been slow. They, ain't been, they, put, they had me scheduled today, last I checked Sunday. They have me scheduled today. I go check today, ready to go to work. I'm off the schedule. I text the man like, um, I know my eyes don't deceive me. He like, yeah, I was just slow, so we had to cut hours. Oh, glad I don't need them for no bills for real. But anyway, Chan, that's the news for that. I'm about to, like I said, I'm about to go work out, and then I'm gonna go slide to my mom's house, give her this food, and then we go come back to the crib. And I'll probably go ahead and edit this video. Next week's vlog, we're gonna talk a little bit more about. What's been going on with my relationship? Like, actually, y'all, I actually been thinking about doing a story time with that. Like, literally, just a story time on marriage, how I see marriage, how I see relationships, all that. So, yeah, we'll get into that. But, 
Let's go work out, baby. Bye. Let them fall slow. I know. Ignore this. We handling that when I get back. You had your fears, you could let them all go. And most women are motivated, so I act accordingly. But this is so refreshing that it means a little more to me. Dedicating time when I really can't afford to be. I'll provide protection if you open up the door for me. Couple stairs, couple texts, couple dates, couple I think that we're ready. Couple I think we should wait. Are we acting like a couple? I'm just trying to get it straight. Cause I'm over here convinced that it's too early for mistakes and then. to run into Dollar General because I need toilet tissue, dish detergent, laundry detergent, and something else. Oh, some soap. And I'm gonna look for them dum-dums in here. I know they got dum-dums in here. I knew with Dollar Tree they probably wouldn't, but they gotta have them in Dollar General, right? All the magic go. I followed the rules and told you everything you had to know. Had you over every night. Every night was passionate. Plus, you met my mother even if it was an accident. I'm confused. Tell me where we go wrong. I was sure that I would be with you for so long. I was planning on this being something worth mentioning. Energy invested in someone I saw potential in. Who killed Shivery? They need to get their sentence in. Meanwhile, we arguing and I can't get a sentence in. Just as I predicted, here we go again. They always say the hottest love has the coldest end. On the way to go work out can y'all believe i don't know i just feel like dollar general is such a hidden gem because i got toilet tissue laundry detergent soap three bars dishwashing liquid a couple of a little snack or two with my dum-dums and it all it was under 16 dollars dollar general is the plug i don't care what nobody's saying so, let's go work out All these nails gonna break off by the end of the day. 
Tchau. Cause I know this really ain't so thing She said you got that right And I call will arrive in 15 She said it's 12.35 But she still got work in the morning I ain't trying to kill the vibe You can see it in my face I'm torn Just like magic They playing our song from way back When we fell in love She put down her jacket And gave me her phone Said that I can't stay But just hold up Just focus on me
That workout was so good. I'm so hungry now. Down to the, down to the, to the flow. Curious for you to try it because I perfected the gravy from scratch. The way Dad taught with flour and water. Yeah, I don't know nothing about no pack. Yeah, I, I fixed the pack. You didn't fall. You went without me. No, when I sent the text and you didn't say I'll come join when I got. But I didn't think it was coming that fast. Yeah, girl, I was already like probably either in Dollar Tree or in Dollar going Tree. to the Dollar General. Oh, okay, so you were. So you when you got up ready to go. Yeah. Okay. A fire? No, a flyer. From who? Or some type of. All right, Nash. Somebody was showing off a little bit. What's that, a mash? Mm mm. Oh, you tasting the chicken, chicken? The oh, oh, yeah. Mm. Decent, right? Yeah. What you seasoning it with? What? The, the gravy? Chicken. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Make me want to go slow and taste every. It's good. I thought I saw one time on your block you had two different types of chicken. Yeah, but the last time the gravy didn't come out, it was too thick. Or it was no. too, like, too much flour, not enough water. Mm. I feel like I done perfected it this time. Yeah, grab you got to uh, maneuver it. But this is good. It's regular mash, and not from scratch. Mm-mm. I could have did it from scratch. I just didn't feel like it. I mm -hmm. did have potatoes, too. Perfect timing. So yeah. what do you rate it? Before I go. Oh, right. You can release that fast. Yeah, I'm ready to go home. Okay. We try to barbecue, too. Walk on Yeah. I got stuck on this baby. Yeah, mm. the bag is worse. Make me want to go home and make some more that you gave me them chicken legs. Mmm, those are good. I'm mm. telling you. I barbecue them. Look at your spirit. Chicken's a 10. That's what I rated it at. Nice and tender. Mm. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's good. Mm. Yeah, it's good. 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 Yeah, I do normally love the pepper queens. Yeah. But I got perfected that big chicken. What's up, what's up, what's up, y'all? So it is currently 5.18. As y'all can see, just finished working out. Def wanted to get back on camera and just do my little outro. This vlog might have seemed a little patchy or whatever, but y'all know the vibes. Y'all already know the vibes, so I didn't even do that. The workout was a 10 out of 10. I'm about to, um... Boy and the workout was a 10 out of 10. Um, I'm about to slide home. Next week's vlog, you know the vibes. Tomorrow is church. So thank y'all so, so, so much for the support thus far. Thank y'all for the consistent support. I've been noticing that. Like, it's been a consistent support, and I love that. I appreciate y'all immensely for that. Please, please, please don't forget it is the Raw's Joe. Be sure to be liking, commenting, and subscribing to be tapped in with all my new and upcoming videos. And per usual, I love y'all. So, peace. I said, okay, 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 okay. My infatuation is turning into another form of what you call it.